mother and her college roommates um, just really got along so well they decided to get together during the summer but one person worked for a canning company so they could only get together between the harvest of the peas and the harvest of the corn so they were the peas and corn girls so I have a thing for peas, pea pods. <laughs> What's not to like about pea pods? They're so fun. Uh, I, I just love to work with um, different scales. So if pea pods are normally this big, um, I'd like to make them really tiny or really gigantic and uh, it just throws uh, a wrench in people's observation. Whatever it is to them, it is. If it's weird or they can't, figure out why anybody would want to do it, or what is it, or that must be bamboo, or just taking something out of context and putting it in a different size, I think just kind of pricks people, people's imagination. I just like my vegetables to speak for themselves. I like people to think that things can just appear out of nowhere, and um, there's sort of serendipity or magic or weirdness um, around the corner. Just makes them, makes them think a little bit. What do you think of this, this piece of art behind you? I think it's beautiful. Yeah. And I think it should be here because it's like a beautiful thing that should be here because things like this don't happen in ordinary schools. They're pretty big. They're pretty huge, to be a real piece. It's gorgeous. Yeah, I've been really impressed with it. Would you like to make something like this? Yeah. You think you will? If they let me. <laughs> <laughs>